Hey, what's up guys, Michigan Edge here. Uh, if you watched my previous video, I took a gamble, I ordered in a couple of Ganzo knives. I wanted to see what all the hype was about, and uh, the previous video I just opened was the Ganzo G720, which uh, I have to say guys, this is an awesome, awesome knife. Highly recommend it. Silky smooth, check out my uh, unboxing video. Very, very stout knife. But what I have here is something totally different. Let's go ahead and open it up. This is should be the G719, which is a automatic knife. And this right here was right around $21. I got this on Amazon. I got one day delivery. I didn't pay for that. Uh, I do have Amazon Prime though. But let's go ahead and unbox this here. Got weight to it. Okay, we got our pretty nice box. Got a nice uh, felt style bag here. This right here caught my eye. This is this right here is man. This feels awesome here, guys. This has got some weight to it, but it's very slim. Let's check this out here. It looks like we got uh, phosphorus bronze bushing. I can't tell. This one right here looks like it may be something different on this side. But uh, I opted for the green G10 here on this side. And this side right here is nice and smooth. Uh, you can get this in a black G10 also. Let's go ahead and see how this works. Pretty smooth, pretty nice. Clip point. Let's see here. G719 440C steel, which I like. I like 440C uh, steel a lot. Uh, locks in nice and tight. The uh, something to note here the button is flush with the handle, so. Uh, and of course, this being your pocket, only only offered a uh, tip up right-handed carry. Uh, even if the button was activated, it won't open in your pocket uh, if you keep it flush in there. But uh, the button is very flush, so this shouldn't be a problem with that opening. You know, it's flush with the handle. I gotta actually want to push it for it to open. But uh, man, this is sweet, guys. And you know, I, I gotta add it in there. Always check with your local law. You know, every state seems like they're different. Uh, these are illegal in a lot of states to carry. But uh, you know how that goes. Check with your local law and carry at your own risk. Uh, of course, I won't be carrying this here in Michigan. I believe they're still illegal here. <coughs> but uh, very nice. Clip retention's awesome. Just like the G720 here, this this right here is is uh, it feels like a super high quality knife, guys, and for twenty dollars. Flow through construction. I kind of like this design here. I like knives like this that have a. It's like you go on this side here. It's like I'm a gentleman, you know. And then you come to this side here, and it's like I'm a badass. I'll kick your ass. It's just, it's kind of cool. I like it. But this is going to slide in your pocket nice and smooth. It's got a very strong clip. And I don't have the exact weight. I would guess this is probably a 5 ounce plus knife right here. Quite a bit of heft to it. Let's just put a tape measure across this. We're looking at about 8 inches overall. And right around just shy of a 3.5 inch blade. We got about a three and a quarter inch cutting edge. But uh, man, guys, this is sweet. I highly recommend this. Like I said, check with your local law to see if this is legal to carry or even to purchase. Uh, but you know how the stupid laws are. But uh, man, awesome. Absolutely no, uh, no side to side play. A slight a slight midget of uh, vertical play. 
very, very slight. Like you, you barely feel it. But uh, quickly, before I end this, I'm gonna check out a box sharpness real quick. Look at that. Super, super, super sharp. Super sharp. I gotta say guys, these are my first couple of ganjos I've, I've purchased uh, and I'm very impressed. I would definitely get more of these. Um, and like I said, this is not a review. This is just my impressions on it in unboxing. But from the quality I'm seeing on this right here, I would have to give this a uh, five out of five. Excellent, excellent quality for the money. It's a sweet blade, guys. There you go. That's the Gonzo G17 automatic knife. Uh, awesome, awesome knife for the money. Very cool. I'd say probably about three millimeters thick on this blade. Uh, this one right here, the uh, G20 has a four millimeter thick blade. But uh, super, super nice knives, guys. This right here is very elegant. Very elegant, very, uh, very slim, slim profile. Opens lightning fast. It feels like a high-end knife. So there you go, guys. I hope you enjoyed the video, and uh, I definitely like these here. Like I said, I'll be getting more of them in the future. I'm very impressed with the quality. Uh, you guys take care, and you guys have yourself a good night. Michigan Edge out.